Hello everyone, welcome to Mitch Teach Media. And today we are going to working with the Microsoft Word. And I'm basically going to show you a special type of tool in Microsoft Word. I know many have not worked with this tool and I know you like it. So on your insert menu, go to shapes and there is among the lines category there is a tool called the freeform shape tool just click on the tool to pick the tool and this is how you work with the tool is a tool used to draw a shape of any dimension just pin i click just click to pin let's click to pin and i can draw a shape any shape i want any shape i want so to complete the process we have to pin it from where you started let's click to pin so you can draw a shape any shape you want because on your shape category there are very many shapes you can choose and the shapes are default so with the free form tool you can draw a shape with any dimension so that is one way you work with it. You just work by pin. Just click to pin, move your pointer, click pin, move your pointer, click pin, and then finish your process. So that's one way you can work with it. Good. Other way is reset menu. Just pull again. You work by dragging. You click and drag to draw any shape. Just draw anything. Draw anything. Draw anything. I just finish by moving that one was not perfect but this is this just click and drag drag and any it way started and there you have your shape you can still format this shape just click on the shape go to format menu and fill the shape with a different color black white yellow so that is the freeform tool is a very nice tool to work with if you want to draw a shape and I'm showing you this because if you check in my tutorials on exercise number three there's a shape you may wonder what should I use to draw that shape but check on my tutorials exercise number three there's this shape I've drawn using that tool and I'm going to do it right away again Using the freeform tool, I click to pin. I can also get a straight line by just pressing the shift key on my keyboard while moving. See, while moving without pressing the shift key, the line use looks wavy. So by just pressing the shift, we get a straight line. So click to pin. And I click to pin. Then click to pin. In. Click to pin down once. Click pin. Click pin complete the process. So there we have half your object. So I can easily again refine this object to look more nicer with more rounded corners. I don't want these sharp corners. So how do I achieve that? Click on the object, right click, then choose edit points. So I now have all the points I used to join this shape and I can easily move the points to something perfect. I can easily move the points to where I want. Just point, then click and drag anywhere I want. So let's point, click and drag. And then I can make these points more smoother by just click on the just point on the point. Just check on my mouse pointer, it changes all the points on the black points. Right click, let's say smooth point. And then using this, I can easily refine it into a very smooth point. Let's see the same way you work with the graphic design software they have the tools to achieve this so 
wanted to see how we can achieve this in Microsoft Word. Can you see the point? There we are. My shape looks more fine. Right click again, edit points. I can still move this bottom point. I can still move it. I can still move this. I can still fill it with a different color format. So you can click on the tool, go to format menu, shape fill, you can fill it with black color. Then we have. We can still size our shape. We just point on the edges. We get a double-sided arrow. So that is the freeform tool. I know you've learned something and if you found that interesting, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and feel free to also share the same to your friends. Thank you.